So hey everyone, so continuing on my segment of trucks around that twenty-five to thirty thousand dollar price point, definitely under thirty thousand, brings me to the Ford dealership. I'm at Auto Nation Ford right now in Corpus Christi, Texas, and I'm looking at some of the trucks that they have on the lot. Now the manager came out, and I have a good relationship with him, but he told me that they're running a really good special. As you know, finding one of these trucks with an MSRP under thirty thousand dollars is nearly impossible. However, the sale that they're running at this specific dealership, and probably most other Ford dealerships near you, is they're taking $10,000 off the price of these F-150s. So specifically, this STX equipped truck right here, which is really a gorgeous looking red, and I'm going to go over some of the details, is actually under $30,000. One of the reasons why that's important is because this is not a two-door truck. This is a full crew cab truck with 20-inch wheel package on it. So let's go over some of the reasons why this might be a good buy for you if you're looking for a pickup truck under $30,000. First of all, this truck comes equipped with fog lights, just like the Ram did that we reviewed before. So that's a really nice upgrade over some trucks that just don't even give you fog lights anymore. So you get fog lights with this truck. As I mentioned a second ago, you get 20 inch wheels, aluminum wheels, and these are Michelin tires. This is an STX package, so it is a variant of the XL. It's basically an upgrade or a style package that gives you a lot of the really nice features of a higher-end truck, but with a lower cost package. This truck does have an EcoBoost engine, which means it is a turbocharged engine. This truck comes with a spray-in bed liner. Three inch wide leaf springs. It's got three of them. Fully boxed frame that's e coated. This truck has keyless entry remote. It does not have a slow opening tailgate, but it's a very lightweight tailgate, so it's very easy to close and to open. It does not have the LED light package. However, you can't really expect that package for a truck that is under $30,000. One thing I really like is that it has spot mirrors on it. So if you look at this truck right next door, which this is a Lariat package, FX4, this one doesn't have spot mirrors even though it has the blind spot detection system. I actually prefer spot mirrors and this truck has them. So for under $30,000, let's see what the interior of this truck gives us. First of all, power windows and door locks, power mirrors. This truck has automatic front headlights, as well as a high mount bed light, fog lights. This truck also has SYNC 3 in it. So you get the full eight inch display on this truck. Who would have thought that you can get a truck for under $30,000 that gives you a full eight inch touchscreen display on it? Essentially, this whole center console area right here is almost the same thing you would get in a Lariat model truck, but you're getting it on a truck for under $30,000. No sunroof in this truck, but that's to be expected. I like the fact that you get a really nice full center console. Now we're stepping into the back seat of this truck. Again, this is a crew cab truck or a super crew, so the space that you get in this truck is massive compared to most. Plus, comes with carpeted interior and floor mat, so you're not getting vinyl interior. And you get the rear AC vents, rear power outlet, as well as a 12 volt socket for, you know, a charger. Let's take a look at the sticker on this truck. So this truck has an MSRP of $38,755. This truck is on sale for almost $10,000 off that price. So you can pick up this truck for under $30,000. It does have an EcoBoost engine. 22 miles combined city highway. 19 city, 26 miles per gallon on the highway. Sirius XM radio, the STX appearance package, which is gonna give you your 275-55 R20 Michelin tires, sync three, rear window defroster, 20 inch aluminum wheels, privacy glass, 23 gallon fuel tank, rear view camera, fog lamps, plus, has a $795 upgrade to the V6 EcoBoost, and it has a 315 gear ratio on the back axle. This is a great value for this truck. 
This is really a package that I think most people would be able to wrap their budget around and their minds around because it gives you so much for the price. Now, all the trucks, I've been able to find some really nice packages. I'm going to be reviewing another Ram in the crew cab configuration that's going to have a very similar package to this one where you're going to get the power windows, power door locks, you're going to get an upgraded engine, and all of that for under $30,000 as well. So don't think that I'm just going to focus on Ford in this case. The whole purpose of this segment is for those people who don't have the ability to go out, look at every single truck, and make that decision, or don't have time to look at every truck on a lot to find that specific package they're looking for, and I want you to be able to take this information, go to your dealership if you're looking for a truck like this, and pick out a very well-equipped truck with a lot of the features you want, or at least you would require, but at a price point that's well within the budget of most people shopping for a truck. One thing that I really like is that they still give you that 4.3 inch LCD display up front. Gives you a lot of good information on it. Gives you really nice steering wheel controls for your Bluetooth, radio, cruise control, all of that. Again, SYNC 3, really nice. Comes with satellite on it as well. So you have Sirius XM radio. Full automated air conditioning controls. Another big upgrade because a lot of trucks don't give you this. 12 volt adapter here, up here on the dash. USB ports down here. So this truck does not have a mirror for the driver, but it does have a mirror for the passenger. The privacy glass on this truck is ridiculous. I was holding my head up to it and you still can't see through it. So they really, really tinted these back windows and the front windows also have privacy glass on them as well. So they're slightly tinted. And here is a shot of the 2.7 liter EcoBoost engine. Very quiet engine. Would not recommend putting aftermarket exhaust on one of these though. It's probably not going to uh, make you feel all that special. You know, something that's pretty amazing about these EcoBoost engines that come in these trucks now, this one has the 2.7 liter. It's an optional V6 EcoBoost engine. It produces 325 horsepower and 375 pound-feet of torque. It's pretty crazy. Typically, when you would look at the type of engines that would come in a truck at this price point, you'd be looking at trucks that have 250 horsepower and maybe 250 pound-feet of torque. But to get a 2.7 liter V6 in this truck that's turbocharged at 325 horsepower and 375 pound-feet of torque is pretty nice. And again, under 30 grand. Here's the rear axle of this truck. Guys, if you're joining my channel for the first time, I really recommend you look back on some of my older videos because I do frame thickness tests. I actually have a caliper that I bring out and I'll get inside these holes and show you exactly how thick the frame is as far as the material itself. I do like that they use three inch wide leaf springs. But just here's a good shot of the undercarriage of this truck in case you've ever wondered. And here's the front suspension, fully independent. This is a two-wheel drive truck. This truck does not have parking sensors on the front or parking sensors on the back. This one does have a hitch included on it though. So guys, as I wrap up this video, the point I wanna make here is even though you may believe that these trucks have gotten so ridiculously expensive, you can find really, really good deals. The MSRP price on a lot of these trucks isn't anywhere near the price you'll actually pay for one of these trucks if you're serious about buying one. Many of the incentives can take a $40,000 truck or a $38,500 truck and bring it well under the $30,000 mark so it's affordable to you. And this package is an optional package, so you don't even have to get the larger engine. You don't have to get the STX appearance package, and you don't even have to get a crew cab or a super crew. That being said, you can get one of these trucks for well under $25,000 if you're looking for a more basic package than what you see here. Remember, the MSRP price on the truck is not the price you're going to pay for it if you A, know how to negotiate, B, you shop around, and C, you look at what incentives are available from both the manufacturer as well as the dealership. 
Anyways, guys, I hope you've enjoyed this video. My next stop's going to be a Chevy dealership and then a Toyota dealership. So I want to give you guys a fair view of all the different trucks and what they offer. I'm even going to go to a Nissan dealership. But I've had some issues with the Nissan dealership here giving me access to their vehicles. So I'm going to have to go out of town for that. Anyways, guys, I hope you liked this video. If you'd enjoyed it, I'd appreciate a thumbs up. And if you would, subscribe to my channel, please. Thank you. So I want to thank Auto Nation Ford in Corpus Christi, Texas. This is actually the dealership where I purchased my 2016 F450. It's a great place to buy a vehicle. Um, they have really good pricing. And if you are in the market for a Ford vehicle, I highly recommend you give them a call um, if you're in the area or if you're willing to make a short trip. Anyways, if you like my channel, please like and subscribe. Thank you.